Ray's surprise trade would send all-star slugger to Red Sox in rare interdivision deal. Welcome Red Sox fans share and subscribe to the channel and activate the notification to receive the latest news from Boston Red Sox. Help us reach the 2000 subscribers so that our channel arrives for more people I count on all of you. Boston could use some right handed pop. Could the Boston Red Sox pull off a notable trade with an interdivision rival in order to further bolster an already potent offense? Red Sox Chief Baseball Officer Craig Breslow reportedly will target starting pitching and a right-handed bat at the July 30th trade deadline which have been the same needs since the beginning of last offseason. While starting pitching remains priority number one, it's also worth noting that the left-handed heavy lineup has struggled against left-handed pitching and will become even more unbalanced upon Tristan Casas' return in the second half. The addition of a middle-of-the-order right-handed bat would do wonders, and the Tampa Bay Rays reportedly are shopping a trio of them. Tampa Bay will listen on Randy, Arozarena, Yandy, Diaz, or Isaac. Paredes in the right deal, MLB Network's John Morosi reported Thursday. Diaz appears to be a solid fit for Boston and could take manager Alex Cora's lineup to a new tier. The 32-year-old is hitting .273 with 30 extra base hits, including 8 home runs, 46 RBIs, and a .726 OPS, 109 OPS+. Plus. In 94 games this season, with the hulking corner infielder in the fold, Cora could deploy a group that includes Diaz, Tyler O'Neill, Rob Rifsinder, Connor Wong, and said Dane Rafaela from the right side, and then continue to use Rafael Devers, Jaron Duran, Wiley Abreu, Masataka Yoshida, Dom Smith, David Hamilton, Reese McGuire, and eventually Casas from the left side. That would allow the coaching staff to create mismatches all game long, something Cora has proven to do time and time again. Diaz would be a perfect first baseman slash designated hitter for the time being with Yoshida platooning in the latter scenario. He's owed $10 million in 2025 with a $12 million club option in 2026. That contract is quite reasonable for the 2023 All-Star who came in sixth place in American League MVP voting while hitting a league leading point three three zero with 22 home runs the slugger would help the lineup immediately and be incredibly easy to trade if top prospects eventually crowd the infield and force some transactions in the future diaz would cost the red sox a decent haul of prospects but nothing substantial the big three prospects would remain on the no trade list in this scenario it's clear that boston will need to add an impact right-handed bat and diaz fits the description fan of the red sox with this possible exchange, can we dream of an unbeatable team? Leave your opinion in the comments and leave your like and share and subscribe to the channel and activate the notification to receive the latest news from Boston Red Sox. Help us reach the 2,000 subscribers so that our channel arrives for more people I count on all of you.